and for any student that is nominated to the program. And then we do that once a year, send that all to our district coordinator and the coordinator uh, crunches all the numbers and lets us know who we get to work with next year. Okay, you know, and, the, and the students seem to have a good time with it. Oh, the students, yeah, they, it's, it's, my class is the highlight of their day. Yeah. <laughs> or so you like to think. Yeah, yeah, that's what I tell them. <laughs> well, I'm sure it's very true. <laughs> well, we're looking forward to seeing the students' projects that are coming up. Anything else you'd like to let us know before we take a look? Uh, no, I just, uh, I just think they'll, uh, they, everybody will enjoy watching these as much as the kids did doing them. And then the kids, uh, I videotaped them, but the kids did a lot of editing and stuff for them too, so they had a lot of fun putting them together. Great. Well, thank you very much for giving us the opportunity to take a look at these videos. So, let's watch. All right. Okay, we have a couple of guys here that have been working on a robotics unit. We're using the Legos Mindstorms, and they're going to tell you a little bit about their first project that was called the Boogie Bot Bop, right? Yeah. And uh, the, uh, they're going to explain how theirs is going, what they had to do to get it done. Okay, go ahead, guys. What, you, what can you tell us about it? Um, um, this is Dr. Professor Jeff. That's what we named him. Yeah. Um, his motors, he has two motors, yes. right it's here and here. He has three wheels, one in the back, here in the back, two wheels, tiny one. But what, what he's going to do at the beginning, he's going to go forward and back, forward and back four times. Um, then he's going to go to the 360 circle, which is the dime 360, and he's going to do a, a ton of other stuff. But it is all control, controlled by the NXT right here. Yeah. and. It gives, you can plug it into the computer and it programs it all. Yeah. And then and it just... It all so you do all the programming on the computer? Yeah. Yep. Then you download the program into the... NXT. Onto the NXT. Okay, I tell you what, let's, let's take a look at it do its thing. Okay? And that was Dr. Professor Jeff's dance. Okay, and it was supposed to take how long? Uh, it should 45 take 45 seconds. seconds. How long he, did yours take? He runs for about 44 seconds. Okay, yeah. Except so once we timed him at 45 and 6 minutes. Okay. Good job. Did it do everything you wanted it to do? Yeah. Yep. Okay, good. What do you think of this? I think it's a cool project. Okay, now we have three girls here who have also been doing the uh, computer uh, or the robotics project and doing their Lego Dacta robot. They built the robot and then uh, programmed it to do, we're all doing the Boogie Bot Bop. And so they're going to explain a little bit about theirs and, and how they did it and a little bit about their robot. <coughs> girls, what can you tell us? Well, this is Squirtle, our robot. And um, we programmed him to do the boogie bot. Um, the boogie bot is basically um, four forwards and backwards, and we have the dime 360, which you'll is probably learn about that 360 later. 360 point turn. Yeah, basically. And how long? It's, it's 45, 45 seconds. 45. Yours was just under 45 seconds, wasn't it? So that's, and, and you've got 45 seconds to do it in, so that works out just great. So uh, you want to show us how yours works? Sure. Okay.
Okay, it looks pretty good. You guys had some uh, extra little wiggles and stuff in there too, huh? Yeah. yeah. How'd you program that? We had to do a bunch of 25 degree turns. 25 degree, 25 degree, 25 each degree. wheel. So each wheel was run separately then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. to alternate them. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Very good. Okay, here we have a couple more girls that have uh, done the boogie bot in the robotics project, mm -hmm. and they're going to tell us a little bit about it. So what can you tell us about your robot and about the boogie bop? Well, our robot's name is Eva, and it's going to do a dance that's about 45 seconds long. And we created the dance, and it's going to do many different things, and I hope you like it. And also, we had makeup things out of Legos, mm -hmm. and some parts are really hard to get and everything, but that's Yeah, this is about Legos. This is all like Legos, except for the cardboard, but that's like all Legos. Okay. How about... Uh, Showing us uh, doing its stuff. Okay, sure. Hi, Mark. Gets it? Go. Okay, good. Thanks a lot, girls. What do you think? What did you think of this project, this first part of it? Uh, it was fun, but it was hard. Yeah. It was really hard getting it to do all that. It was hard. But it was fun. I want to do the next one, though. That sounds like Okay, fun. we're on to the next project, right? Yeah, the next project is, it's kind of like a game. Okay, well, good. Well, well you'll see next time. Yeah. Da -da -da -da. Thanks a lot. <laughs> You're always And then, um, like, like, I have to see if he gets the like, three minutes, and he's like, and he pulls it on, he's just like, now that's a knife. And he takes the knife away. Yeah. yeah. So you know, so, you know so, when yours is going good when it follows that first line. Back wheel. I want a yeah. failure. And needs to be taught a lesson. And come for it. Doing a good job. All right. On tape. That pretty much uh, fits all the requirements. Okay, Mackenzie. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about your robot. Ev you and Evan did this together, but Evan's not here today to yeah. tell us about it, right? Mm -hmm. So why don't you tell us a little bit about your robot and how you programmed it, and what you did? Like, what do you mean about what I thought I did? Well, how did you? What did you have to design on the robot? Um, for this one, um, we had to put on something right here to push the pong thing to push the bottle caps forward. And these pieces put those on, and then 